What's up guys, my name is Pocket Island and this is the Defenders of Steve mod. And well, first of all, there's actually a little backstory to this mod that the mod developer has added and I actually kind of recreated that, so let me, let's go take a nice peek of that. So one day Steve was walking along with Notch Pop out of nowhere and he was like, Hello, said he. Hello, old wise one, said Steve. Are you being harassed by mobs all day, Steve? asked the god of Minecraft. Yes, they attack me all day, most powerful one, replied Steve. Then, Sir Steve, take this head of your identical twin and use it to make more mobs that will help you win battle, said Notch. Thank you, O Great One, I am a mere candle flame compared to your greatness, gushed Steve. The Notch vanished in a cloud of dust, but I don't know how to do that, so there was no dust. Now what can I do with this, thought Steve. But the Notch reappeared in an instant, and he was like, You can make many friendly mobs with this head in three different tiers of greatness. Look! Okay, so I hope you guys like that little backstory to this mod, so now let's get on to the mod. So what Notch actually gave Steve were these three heads. Tier 1 head, Tier 2 head, and Tier 3 head. They kind of just change in eye color, and it looks kind of weird because it's just like, you have Steve's head in your head. You kill him, and then chop his head off, no, okay. But what you can do with this head is that when you uh, put them on top of certain block combinations, you can spawn in mobs just like you would spawn in an Iron Golem or uh, NPC. And here are the five mods, my mobs. Or NPCs and that guy is trying to heal this guy wow terrible aim okay so let's see how to craft it so to craft the tier 1 head all you're gonna need is three pieces of dirt one soul sand three sand and two spider eyes to craft the tier 2 head you're gonna need three piece four pieces of soul sand two diamonds and three sand and lastly the tier 3 head will require two eye of enders and it's very similar to the tier 2 crafting recipe now let's go look at the mobs first. So the first mob I'm gonna go over is the archer. Let's actually put ourselves in creative. Okay, there you go. And here is a tier one archer right here. All he does is shoot uh, bows. I mean, shoot arrows at mobs. Pretty simply, and as you guys can see, he's shooting that guy right there. And up close, he's actually really bad, as you guys just saw there. Okay. Next one is the knight. This guy is just like the iron golem. Pretty much the exact same recipe, only the Steve head is there. And he is much faster. However, he only has a quarter of the health. Next guy is the mage. And this guy is immune to fireballs and lava. And just fire overall. He's great if you go in the nether. And he's able to shoot fireballs. And he spawn this guy in. As you guys can see, it's kind of like the fire charge. And he is just shooting it, and he's kind of missing right now. And no one will the knight died. Oh, and also when the knight dies, he drops uh, iron ingots. So the next one is gonna be the assassin. And this guy hates priests as an atheist, and he is able to sh um, throw knives. And actually, you guys even can get the knives in your inventory, just like that. And if you right click, you can throw them just like that. And also the fire charges. And the lightning balls, the healing balls actually, you can even still use those. <laughs> and, oh no, I that guy. Okay, and so the last one is the priest. So if you just put the Steve hand on top, and here's the priest, he doesn't really attack, but he does heal you, so... If you actually, actually just jump over here. And then jump off, this is gonna fall damage. Oh no, wow, he doesn't want to heal me though, he wants to heal the other guys. <laughs> yeah, but that's the... Uh, priest, he does not heal assassins or other priests, just him, uh, just all the, all the other mobs, including yourself. And look at those guys. These guys are all healing each other, which is good. There as well. Okay, so now let's go over into tier 2 NPCs. So they're basically the same, so here's the knight. They do, um, that's actually the archer. Here's the knight. They do look different. Here's the mage. Here's the assassin. And here's the priest. They're basically the same, only this guy can actually, um, help you and... Uh, the priests will actually, um, when they hit you, they will give you a nice advantage because they do give you fire protection. And right now, here we go. And as you guys can see, fire resistance 4, which is kind of cool as well. And now there's tier 3. And tier 3 is pretty alike as well. Let's go set this all up. Oh, now, as you guys notice that you do not need nether break anymore. You will actually need a full diamond block to spawn the mage. It's actually quite expensive. So tier 3, like that as well. So the only difference with tier 3 is 
that the assassin will give you slowness, the, his knives will hit, he'll give um, the enemy slowness, so... Right here, as you guys can see, this guy now has a potion on him, a potion of slowness. And the priest will actually give you regeneration and all these other benefits. So let's actually spawn in the priest again, see if he can hit, hit us. As you guys can see, I think he just hit me. Mm -mm. Oh, this guy, I didn't get too much from this guy. But he does give you other stuff as well. So these are the defenders of Steve. I hope you guys enjoy this mod and spawn these guys and then go on your adventures. And these guys will come around and aid you and protect you from all those nasty mobs. So thanks for watching guys. My name is Pocket Island and this has been the Defenders of Steve mod and I just cut Steve's head off and put him in my arm. Thanks for watching.